Hi everyone, it's Deborah. Welcome to my channel. Uh, my daughter should be getting out of jail soon, either 11 days or 28, she said, I guess for good time. That I don't think most of the prisoners never know until the CO comes and gets them. Uh, so she's not doing well because she's one of these people that is not going to come out uh, in good spirits. Um, she's beginning to stutter. Oh my God. Uh, it is so traumatic to her, uh, that she is, she's just one of these people that's not going to come out better, you know? And, um, it's very sad. She can't get any decent sleep because, of course, they keep the lights on and they do the checks. They're supposed to check every 30 minutes. A lot of COs don't. Um, she doesn't have any good food. Every time She's already lost 10 pounds. She said the food looks like dog food. Yes, I know this. Um, some jails have pretty good food because when I was a deputy... Um, the sheriff's wife was the cook, and she would have fried chicken. I mean, old Southern cooking it really good. People would fight over the food there. But, um, yeah, and she uh, had a lot of her commissary stolen. She's just not doing well, and it will take her probably two weeks to when she gets out to acclimate to even be able to communicate with people. You know what I'm saying? So, and they don't give you good medical care in there. Oh yeah, I know. So, yes, I know it's jail. But uh, I do think there's a train in Orlando and Kissimmee that she could get on if, if, her probation officer will allow her to come and visit with people. <clears throat> I don't think she's going to be visiting her dad anytime soon. Yeah. Yes. Um, so, I will say goodbye. I'm going to go get something to eat. <laughs> <laughs>